I can't see across the street. It's just a big fog. I can't even see the building. I've been on this street for 32 years, so I know it like this, the back of my hand. But my biggest fear right now is when I move and I'm not familiar, what's going to happen to me? Yeah. We're here with Diane again. Diane is really antsy about going outside, huh? Let me check out. Are you sure you want to walk outside? Yeah, you I want to walk, to, walk the to the store. All right, I'm going to follow you. Close the door, remember? Okay, that's just my <clears throat> We're going to walk around. <laughs> Hi, right. I'm going to the store. Who's that? It's Linda. Go ahead, go in, Linda. I'll be right back. Come okay. on, you two. Thanks. You want to get interviewed? <laughs> no. Hi, <laughs> that's how I got famous. <laughs> That's right, my ahead. friend Linda. She hey, works Linda. the track. Hi. She what? I'll be right back. I'm going to get a pack of cigarettes. Linda, Bye, here. Linda. Linda, go in. I'm locking you in. I got my food stamp card, finally. So, let me see. How are you going to do that, door? Man, good. you got some friends that can help you out, huh? Not really. I'm going to lock them in now. Man, just two months ago, like six, what, four months ago when I interviewed you, your eyesight was great. Yeah, now I'm blind. And you trust all these people going in and out of your home? Just them two. Yeah, oh, just them two? Yeah, I trust them. Yeah. They're not going to take anything, but a lot of people, other people, Yeah. they come to my house talking about, I want to help you. Could yeah. I do this? Could I do that? Yeah, no. <clears throat> then I'm looking for stuff and I can't find it. Yeah. Because they re rearranged my stuff and yeah. want to borrow this and take that. And next thing I know, I got nothing. Yeah. You know, it's okay, though. It's materialistic. Yeah. You know, and I feel bad for them when they're out on the streets, a lot of them, especially the women. Yeah. But I learned that you can't help everybody. Because now I'm starting to figure out that my stuff is falling apart like... One drawer is all crooked, and the back of the drawer, they pulled down the wood. I don't know if they was looking for my money or what the hell they was doing. And being I can't see, and I only see shadows, especially in my house. I got all the lights on, but it looks like it's total black. All I see is people's shadows, and they know this. So they'll come in and try to smoke dope. And sometimes I'll catch them, but a lot of times I won't because I can't see what the hell they're doing when they're behind the door in my bathroom. Um, yeah, every time they try to help or they say they're going to help, they always, it's always all bad at the end, you know? I can't find what I'm looking for because they move stuff around. I tell them, if you're going to use something, Put it back where it is because I can't see. And I have to know where everything is in my house. Right now, I'm in the process of being moved. Yeah. Because my husband died, not my husband, but the guy I was with 19 years. He's from the downtown area of Las Vegas. He was a blood, you know, whatever. Um, and when he died, see, he never let me hang out with any of these street people. He always kept me with no friends, especially his um, associates or people he surrounded himself with. He never let me talk to them or hang out with them. And I thought he was being mean, but now I know why. Because they're all users and they all got ulterior motives. Um, and now I understand kind of, sort of, how he gave up on himself you know, as far as taking care of himself, as far as his addiction. I'm glad I stayed far away and didn't surround myself with that. And now I'm letting these people in, now I'm realizing what <laughs> they're about. And it's too late because I already let one in and one will bring 10. And hmm. now sometimes I'm scared to be in my own house are you leaving here soon um yeah how long you make sure you I contact me i can't disclose where i'm yeah. moving but i know it's very i don't soon. want none of them knocking on my door no no i know it's me. very soon i'm not gonna say any date because but. if i leave, if i stay here i'm gonna wind up being evicted 
because of the type of people that are coming to my house that I felt sorry for and allowed them to come in, take a shower. Now it's 24 seven where I got people knocking on my door. Yeah. Uh, could I have some water? Three o'clock in the morning. Uh, one guy, I thought his voice sounded familiar. I can't see faces. All I see is shadows. Like you're doing right really good now, right now. I can see your shadow. Okay, you're following I me. I can see the sidewalk because it's dark, but everything else is a big fog. Okay. I can't see across the street. It's just a big fog. I can't even see the building. I've been on this street for 32 years, so I know it like this, the back of my hand. But my biggest fear right now is when I move and I'm not familiar, What's going to happen to me? <laughs> well, listen, I know Well, I know that you're moving very soon. So. Right now, I see light. Everything's uh, light where, and shadows. But within three months, I'm going to be legally totally blind because unless my glaucoma you get help, is in correct? a progressive state. Yeah. Can a specialist yes. help you, though, or no? Yes, but my insurance will yeah. not cover it. Hopefully, um, we can find someone. I need LASIK surgery. Can you see? No, I can see the curb right here. Can you help? Oh, you're no. pretty. You're you're a natural. Can I cross? Yeah, careful, don't cross there. Don't cross yet. Just follow me, and then I'll cross you when you're ready. Come on. I can see the white of your pants. Yeah, just follow me. <laughs> so, do you do you remember all these neighborhoods you used to walk? Well, I've been on this street 32 years. So you were. Uh, this was the blade for you. Yeah, I used to work that corner right there. <laughs> Show me the corner where you worked at. I gotta um, see it. 21st and Fremont. Oh. I used to live in that hotel over there. Um, the safari, but it's closed down. Get over here closer to me. You're in the street. Come here. Okay, come on. Cross street. Okay, come on. I got you. Come on. Just tell me when I hit the curb, all right? Okay, this way, this way, this way. Am I getting close? No, no, you're not even close. Come on. I'll help you up in the curb. No, just tell me when to lift my you, feet. I know you want to do it yourself. I know, I know. Keep going slowly. So keep going, keep going, keep going. You got, you got a little bit of ways. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Slow, 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 slow. All right, now you can go. All right, let's go over there. Show me the corner where you hung out at. Over there. In this You're corner, I used to work at between this corner <laughs> and Boulder Highway, which is down to the left. Come here. Um, I could walk around here blind. There's no Come problem here. because I know everything. Do you know where you're at now? Yeah. Show me, okay, so I, oh, is that the corner you stood on right here? Like I said, I can see shadows. Right. I can't see across the street. It looks like Do a you fog. see this red pole right here? But I can see, um, I can see forms. Yeah. And so you used just to hang, not So this was your spot right here, huh? Yeah, I used to live in that motel. I used to live in that motel. That one? Pretty much all of them on the block, yeah. But so, now that I'm going blind, I don't work out here anymore. Yeah. All right, we're going to go in the store now? Yeah, I'm going to go. Store. What are you trying to get? A pack of cigarettes. All right. And maybe a couple of things with my food stamp. Okay, yeah, that's right. With cigarettes, I gotta pay for. Is it even open? Oh, it is open. Huh? Will it let us record in there or no? Huh? Will it let us record in there? Um, I don't know. Maybe You're I'm... gonna have to ask her. Oh, right. Where's. Oh, can you do it? You don't help. Yeah, where's the door? That it's one? Coming. Or yep, that... keep going straight. Is this Apple Jacks? Yep, Apple Jacks. You want that one? Yeah. You want both of them? Maybe. Okay, slowly. I know my way home that way. Yep. You're good. If I see any cracks, I'll tell you. Hey. For the, those watching, Diane wanted to do this all on her own. Correct, hmm. Diane? Yeah. She had minimal help in the store. Well, I've been around here 32 years on this block alone. Yeah. So. Oh, you want to go this way? Huh? I'm blind now. I'm legally blind. blind. Why? Um. This one blind got glaucoma. Can I have a cigarette? What do you mean? How? What I don't want to talk about it. It's hard enough. Are you okay? No, I'm not okay. I see shadows and lights. That's it. It's scary. Yeah, I'm going to be totally blind in about three months.
I got glaucoma, it's a blind disease. I didn't know I had it and it's too late now. All right, you want me to help you now the rest of the way? Just tell me. Go straight. Yeah, I'm just trying to figure it out. I can see bright colors, that's it. Come on. <laughs> 